At this point in the program, it is my extreme pleasure to introduce to you our Guardian Angel Society student speaker, Dang Garang, a junior at Bishop Grimes. As you will hear from him, Dang's story mirrors the vision Father Champlin had for his students 25 years ago. Dang's journey reflects the hard work and commitment of his family as they fled from the Second Sudanese Civil War and journeyed to Egypt, where Dang was born, and then on to the United States when Dang was only one year old. That hard work was shown clearly in Dang's accomplishments. Academically, Dang received summa cum laude status on the honor roll while taking two AP classes. Athletically, on the basketball court, Dang was named the most outstanding player in the Grimes Martin Luther King Tournament, selected Section 3 First Team All-Star, and is now part of an AAU team traveling with the Nike Elite League. His work ethic and humble attitude are bright examples for his siblings, teammates, and peers, and frankly, all of us. Please join me, ladies and gentlemen, in welcoming our student this evening, Dang Garang. Thank you. You guys hear me well? Can you hear me? Well, this isn't going to be easy since I'm the youngest one here, but I'd like to take you all back to a time where many say are the best of their lives. Are you kidding me? Homework, balancing schedules, relationships. Don't get me started on college. With all that being said, we call you some help. And I guess that's why I'm here today. My name is Dan Gring and I'm a junior at Bishop Grimes High School. I've been a part of the Guardian Interest Society since I was in first grade. I'd like to take a few moments today to share a few memories of the program, how it has shaped me, and where I'll go from here. Throughout my years of school, I've been fortunate enough to do well and maintain a strong GPA. This has not come without a little help, though. The Orange Society has consistently monitored my grades and offered help when needed. Through monitoring my grades, encouraging my progress, and sometimes just being a family to lean on, they have put me in a position to succeed when many my age are not. All these memories have took a major part in shaping who I am today. Academically and athletically, they have put me in a place where hard work and integrity have become a way of life. In fact, last year, Syracuse.com accidentally credited me with nine points that should have gone to a teammate. Although it looked really good on a box score, I knew that it was wrong, that a mistake had to be fixed. I called Syracuse.com and reported the mistake. Although I may regret it if I end up with 991 points in my career. The guy that shared with me, I feel as if all these experiences have prepared me for my future. Next year, I will be applying to colleges that will expose me to a whole new world that members of my family have never been able to reach. Father Champlin knew that we all needed a guardian angel. And even though I never got to meet him, I'm glad I've got to be a recipient of his mission. Thank you.